hello guys welcome back to my a new video and in this video i will talk about separate application and uh, basically i will talk about one particular university joint application is already over and uh, written test is uh, already gone and uh, there might be that many of you didn't pass in the written test because the exam was really difficult so let me show you one separate application that you can make the application now and there is no entrance exam in this uh, application so you can make the uh, application now let me show you from studyinfo.fi from this website so let's go to the study info portal so uh, you are here studyinfo.fi or opintoporco.fi and then from here you can search samk okay let's search here so this is Sata Kunta University of Applied Science. They didn't uh, participate in the joint application, I think. And uh, you can apply uh, to separate application to this university. You can see Bachelor of Engineering Mechatronics. This is a program. This is open for separate application. Uh, Bachelor of Engineering Artificial Intelligence. Bachelor of Hospitality Management International Tourism uh, all of these are open now you can make the application I will uh, I will go and show you how to make the application and I will also tell the requirements for the application to this university so let's go and check one of these let's open to a new browser So this is a 240 ECTS credit uh, bachelor degree and uh, this is a full-time study and uh, the city is Pori. Pori is a city in Finland and uh, tuition fees is uh, 10,500 data and teaching application is ongoing. Okay, let's click this one. No scholarship for this uh, university. This is you can see separate application uh, and the application will end february 15 15th of february 3 pm finish time so you still have few days and for this study program mechatronics there is 50 places uh, for the students let me check for artificial intelligence how many study place and in this degree program uh, there is 50 so 100 study place in this two degree program and then there is also hospitality management uh, let me check hospitality management how many study places in this degree program okay there is th 30 study places in this degree program so you can apply okay let's see if there is business related you can also apply to nursing in this degree program then international business this is also a full-time study then physiotherapist if you want to apply you can also apply to this university all of these are open what i am showing you here and then uh, not this one i think this is not sunk this is in finnish so i don't need this okay so let's go and apply to one of these okay so uh, i will click this fill in the application form and then you can see the requirement from here if you are applying uh, to bachelor degree program uh, you need to upload your upper secondary level certificate or vocational qualification certificate or higher education certificate uh, and then if they are not in English the certificate and transcript they must be translated to English or Finnish or Swedish if you want to apply to master's degree you can apply to this university but you need two years of work experience after your graduation and you can apply I will show you uh, so you can apply to maximum three study choices in this university 
if you have question okay can i apply to this university because i uh, apply to joint application this is a separate application and you can make uh, application to this university now i will show you uh, the requirement uh, for getting uh, chances to this university after uh, making the application okay let's uh, choose i will choose uh, international business and i will also choose uh, artificial intelligence like three of the bachelor degree programs if you want to apply master's degree let's remove one and you can apply a master's degree here uh, this is the one business sustainable business management i will click one so you can apply both of them together bachelor or masters or if you want to apply only to masters remove all of them and just apply like okay part time uh okay part time okay then you can fill up the application and if you are applying to master's degree you need to upload your bachelor's degree certificate and mark sheet and also you need to uh, apply a work experience certificate here and it has to be two years 24 months and you can apply uh, when you click the link okay and if you are applying to bachelor's degree let's remove all of this add study program this then you need to upload your uh, higher secondary or upper secondary school certificate and you also need to upload your passport here okay english language test this is optional english language test this is optional but you will get one points from english language test if you have ilts 6.0 or if you have pte academic or P pte online result uh, you can see if you have like pte at least 51 you can get one bonus points or one extra points uh, or if you have IL 6.0 you can get one extra point either one of these you can upload uh, but it says English language test is not obligatory or is not mandatory if you don't have you can leave it like this no and you can upload your educational certificate and documents uh, to make this application so how the result will be uh, calculated so let me show you from here you can read the admission criteria so you will be selected from this selection method two. this method paper selection for applicants with foreign certificate this is for the foreign students or for the foreigners who is not from finland and this uh, selection method two will be applicable for applicants with a finnish vocational qualification uh, let me uh, go to the main scoring the certificate so your certificate will be scored from 0 to 5 so if you have ccpa 5 out of 5 you will get 5 if you have 4.5 you will get 4.5 so your ccpa is the very important part in this uh, scoring selection and then uh, there will be grade from your english language test which will be 1 so total scoring will be uh, 6.0 but remember if you have a uh, score in mathematics or study in the field of business those will be uh, those will be calculated or those will be uh, evaluated in this uh, selection method and you can say applicants with the best gps and grades will receive five points and the score will given with the smallest difference of 0 0.1 points so you can uh, you can be selected if you have like uh, 0 0.1 uh, above than the other applicants uh, greater than the other applicants if you get like okay 4.5 and if somebody uh, else got like 4.4 you will get chance or if somebody else got, get like 4.6 he will get he or she will get chance so the your cgp is very important and if you have uh, ielts or pta score this is also important so this is a separate application you can make the application now and uh, I, I don't know if you have good score in your uh, higher secondary if you have good score then you have 
possibility or probability to get a uh, admission in this university so hopefully this video will be useful for you if it is useful just thumbs up and uh, if you are new to my youtube channel consider subscribing to to my youtube channel see you to my next video until then take care and bye bye